Jafar, this is an outrage. If it weren't for all your years of loyal service, but from now on, you're to discuss sentencing of prisoners with me before they are beheaded. I assure you, Your Highness, it won't happen again. Jasmine, Jafar, now let's put this whole messy business behind us. Please. My most abject and humblest apologies to you as well, Princess. At least some good will come of my being forced to marry. When I am queen, I will have the power to get rid of you. <laughs> there, now, that's nice. All settled then. Now, Jasmine, getting back to this suitor business. Jasmine? Jasmine! Oh, if only I had gotten that lamp. I will have the power to get rid of you. Oh, to think we gotta keep kissing up to that chump and his chump daughter for the rest of our lives. No, Iago. Oh. Only until she finds a chump husband. Then she'll have us banished. Or beheaded. Ooh. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, Jafar. What if you were the chump husband? What? Okay, okay, you marry the princess, all right? And, and, uh, you, then you become the soul. Oh. Marry the shrew. I become the sultan? The idea has merit. Yes, merit, yes! And then we drop Papa-in-law and the little woman off a cliff. Yeah! Her splat! <laughs> <laughs> I love the way your foul little mind works.